Who would take the fucking time to write this? R733 says, it looks okay, but it's not Transformers. It really isn't. And the sad thing is we tried. Like when I went into it, I was like, this is my Transformers. And everyone was like, what are you talking about? There's no robots in this. It was like, not that you can see, but this movie's gonna be more than meets the eye. Tron Swanson. That's a wicked name for the internet. Tron Swanson says, looks like fun. I'll be there opening night. Proper stone. Thank you, Tron. That way it will be funny regardless. He's absolutely right. St. Cloud says Affleck was the bomb and Phantom Joe. You'll hear from my lawyer. That's my line. You're gonna say it? You gotta pay me like 50 cents at least. Chris Hona says, damn, Silent Bob didn't age. Right, Chris Hona? All you have to do is like lose weight, substantial amounts of weight. So when I'm 80, if I lose 80 pounds, I'll look fitty. Phil K said, the f is the internet? Thank you for keeping that alive. That joke aged incredibly well. The internet is still a thing. I was worried when we did that movie. I was like, ah, oh, nobody knows about this except me and my friends. It really caught on. Joey Dillinder 1991. I wonder when he was born. Everyone is commenting on their looks and how old they got. I'm just here like, holy sh I'm, I'm pretty sure Justin Long's character is Brandon St. Randy. Joey, faith will be rewarded. You're absolutely right. He is, Justin Long is playing Brandon St. Randy from Zack and Mary Make a Porno, so I got to pull that universe into this universe, the Vusk universe. Man, universes colliding. Good looking out. Something tells me you like me or not a person that gets laid very often. Jess Lal. If I say Jay and Silent Bob suck balls, will they show up to my place? Don't be ridiculous, but if you say it three times in a mirror, we will. We are the new Candyman and Bloody Mary, so be careful what you say into a mirror. Jay and Silent Bob might show up and borrow money from you because we're old and we're not as popular as we once were. The next one comes from Mr. Sensible. Reboots and delayed comedy sequels decades after the original are always awesome. This guy lives up to his name, Mr. Sensible. Like, all of that made sense. All of it I co-sign and agree with. I salute you, sir, as being the smartest, wisest person on the internet. g Raj one says, this looks awesome. You know what? Mr. Sensible. g Raj one is the smartest person on the internet. This looks awesome, says g Raj one for all you who thinks it looks dumb, what the f was that? Well, you clearly weren't raised in the 90s, which, since it's the internet, that's everybody. Probably best to stick with Paw Patrol. You have not seen Jay and Silent Bob reboot, so just for one day, put Paw Patrol aside. I know it's tough because puppies doing shit, but reboot happens once, maybe twice in a lifetime, so. History's happening, kids. Even if you're like, I don't know these characters, all of these people look old and lost. Why am I interested in this? And am I getting it for free? Because I'm a member of the internet generation and everything comes to me for free. If you're that person right now, put yourself to the side and think about me for a change. What about good old Kev, man? Mr. Morty Smith. I was raised in the 90s, dot, dot, dot. Hopeful, feeling good about his comment, Morty Smith. I'm like, right on, I was raised in the 90s too. He concludes with his closer, this looks awful. Um, okay, well, there it is. I don't, I don't know what to tell you, man. Mr. Morty Smith lost his heart, kids. That happens, sometimes you get older. Those of us that were raised in the 90s, like Mr. Morty Smith, can't all hold on to that magic that the 90s held. And we aged into little dick bags like him, who just don't like shit anymore. This looks awful. Who would take the fucking time to write this? You ain't got nothing better to do, Mr. Morty Smith. Well, there it is, there's your answer. If you're ever gonna go to the internet to share your feelings and thoughts, make it positive. There's a bunch of assholes on the internet spreading negative things. Go try to find something negative from me in the last like 10, 15 years. All I tell you about is what I like. You'll never hear about what I don't like in this world, except for Mr. Morty Smith. What a f Kids, that's it. I've literally answered every question on the internet. That, that didn't take as long as I thought it would. If you like that video, why not check out the cast of IT Chapter 2 responding to your IGN comments as well.